Tonight, a second person here in the U.S. has been diagnosed with coronavirus. Health officials say that at least 24 people outside of mainland China have been diagnosed at this point. The CDC says a woman in her 60s from Chicago who traveled to Wuhan, China in late December has been infected. A man from Seattle also has a confirmed case of the coronavirus. Health officials in North Carolina and New York are looking into suspected cases. Meanwhile, China has taken drastic measures to stop the spread of the dangerous virus. The city of Wuhan, where the disease was first detected, is rushing to build a new hospital in just six days dedicated to treating coronavirus patients. So far, 26 people have been killed in China. Hundreds have been sickened. In China right now, there are 13 cities and 350 million people on lockdown. Meanwhile, here at home, scientists at a company called Moderna in Norwood are busy working on a vaccine to battle coronavirus. We sat down with the president of the company today who told us the trouble in an emergency situation like this one is if you wait, it may be too late. We've already selected antigens, both ourselves uh, and in partnership with the NIH, identified uh, antigens that we think are the right ones for trying to make this first vaccine. Um, and we're in the process right now of rapidly scaling up that manufacturing. Um, I think it's been publicly stated, uh, and, and, and certainly we agree, that the goal is to get that into humans as fast as possible. And right now that company tells us it's working on more than a half dozen infectious disease vaccines.